know, I just rode as hard as I could. Uh, it's awesome racing against Kerry because I know he's really fast. And uh, he outpedaled me a bit, but I felt like I could take it to him on the descents and the corners. So I really tried to push it today and put pressure on him when I could. question is how do you go that hard dude because it sounds like you were gonna die in five minutes but then every time I see you you're still going that hard um I couldn't really go that hard yesterday because of the long race but today um I went out a lot harder than usual trying to keep with the top guys and just kind of seeing how long I could take it and I think knowing the trails was really helpful so I could know exactly how to meter my energy but I just think about breathing the whole time, just breathing as deeply and as quickly as possible, and it managed to work for most of the race. Uh, today was really fun. It was great day to finish up three days of stage racing, you know, really fast, flowy, fun trails, you know, good stuff, great event, you know, just, just a blast to ride and have fun. I mean, I really didn't have the legs today to stay at the front end, but I still had a blast, you know, just all around good stuff. Good single track. Up and down all day. Uh, no real extended climbs, but yeah, it was really, really impressive. This is, in my opinion, one of the best riding facilities in New England. Um, like, Do you get here besides for the race? This is my first time here, oh. um, and I plan on coming back. Um, I know that they do a midweek training race series here, and I would love to come and check that out. Um, all the tech features that you need to work on when you're going as hard as you possibly can. I did two berms where my suspension compressed and my tires made that sound. And I was like, I just did it. I think that sounds called brap. Oh, I brapped. You brapped. I brapped. It was so awesome.